Well, hello there, guys. Um, welcome to another video. I am going to be filming a get ready with me. This is, anyway, so we're gonna be focusing on more of a, like, my go-to makeup look. Like, just eyeliner, makeup kind of thing. Just not too much. And then for hair, I'm still trying to decide. I always like to do my makeup first and then do my hair because it's kind of like I have an idea of what I'm going for. I think I'm gonna straighten my hair because it kind of like, I feel like there's already too much going on with the outfit with the design in the back and then the plaid on it. So yeah, if you guys wanna see how I get ready, then just keep on watching. Well, hello there. Oh, get out, no. Okay, I'm gonna try and keep the door shut to just make sure that nobody interrupts me. So I'm gonna be using my um, Maybelline foundation. It's in the shade, I don't know if you guys can see this, but it's in the shade 220. Hold on. Hello. Hey. hey. Okay. Sorry, I had to answer that phone call. Um, anyway, um, to, for foundation, I'm going to be using this um, Real Technique Blender. Um, I've used these for years. They work perfectly fine for me. For eyeshadow, I'm going to be using the Naked Urban Decay Basics. I have this Mealy, 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 Mini um, uh, eyeshadow palette for traveling because when I go out and stuff, when I'm out of state, I like to use a small one. So I use... I use this little one for when I travel. And I'm just gonna be using like the basic um, colors. I'm gonna be using Venus for like my whole lid. And then I'm gonna be um, using the brown faint for blending um, just to like define my lids because my lids are very like, I have really chinky eyes, so yeah. And I'm gonna start off with eyeshadow and then go on to foundation, anyway. So I technically just, um, it looks shitty right now, but I've been using the faint to just blend in all my color. I'm doing the Tattoo Liner by Kat Von D. And I'm just going to do a winged eyeliner, nothing special or anything, just a winged Okay, now we're back. Um... I'm gonna have to talk over all the music that I'm playing, so. Anyway, so I've done the eyeliner. Guys, I swear I'm gonna get better. I'm, I haven't had makeup on for a very long time. I haven't put on makeup because I just kinda like, my face needs to recover because I just, when I use a lot of makeup, it like, it messes with my face. So I did a brown eyeshadow, like dark, and then did winged eyeliner, and then I add um, the Marc Jacobs I got this on like a gift. I got the Marc Jacobs eyeliner. This is honestly the best eyeliner. If you need an eyeliner, it might be a little more expensive than like a Wet n Wild one dollar eyeliner. But trust me, like if you could get your hands on one of these, I don't know if this. Is a, oh, okay, there. If you can get your hands on these, this is the best thing you could afford. Cause I mean, you forget because honestly, hands down, best eyeliner. Look. And that was with no oil, no cream, no nothing. Sometimes you can like use oil to like make it slide easily. Does that make sense? So, yeah. So anyway, I did the eyeliner and everything. I'm gonna go into my eyebrows now. And for eyebrows, I like to use the um, Milani. I use a lot of drugstore, like I said, because I don't have a, um, I don't have a like, makeup store really close to home. I'm going to be using the Milani Shade 3 Medium Brown in um, for my eyebrows. Okay, I'm going to be using this shade and then I'm just using the brush that it comes with. It actually works really well. Some brushes are very like floppy or feathery. This one's like very firmly straight, hardly any um, bristles on it. And then it has like the little brow stuff. I 
like to use the my hand as like a little workspace um, to put like the makeup and stuff. I'm gonna go in with a flat brush to clean um, my eyebrows now. Because I'm actually curious to see who's actually watching my videos and who actually pays attention. I know some of my friends said they would watch them, but that I'm weird because I'm actually sitting here talking to a camera. Oh my god. Anyway, I'm going to be playing one of my favorite songs. Just a little bit of it because I don't want to get in trouble. You want my discretion, no sin. I feel you on me when I touch my skin. Is it too late? But now it's hard to breathe. I want to get copyrighted, so. Do you want my videos to stay up, okay? So. Um, yeah. Eyebrows are done. Now I'm going with, um foundation my face has been really dry so i gotta I have to put my hair up for this because i hate getting foundation on my hair okay again i'm going in with maybelline foundation Are trapped. I'm sorry. With my um, eyeshadow brush, just to like blend out to make sure that there's no harsh edges, like here and here, kind of blend that out. Here and just take it off. Nothing special. And on um, like my T-zone area, I just want to look bright and pretty like i actually try like that's my biggest thing when i do like natural look i want to look more brighter than um the sun okay um i want to look bright so i go in with that and then i take this it's um pro conceal it's this of the la girl i use it as a contouring and it's very very creamy so a little goes a long way so like literally that perfect I don't know, I see people on YouTube do this, so it's my own thing now. I do it down here because I like to make my chin look like longer and prettier. When you put a little bit under your lid, it makes it appear like fluffier or like, you know, cuter. Okay, so my camera battery just died, so I had to put it to charge. But I'm gonna take a food break because I'm starving. I have not had anything all day. It is 5.19, so. I'm gonna eat a slice of pizza and I'm also having this rice pudding with cinnamon. It's like lecheros if you're Mexican or like Latino, you know that lecheros is a shit. I'm having that. Um, and yeah, I'm waiting for my friend to show up so we can go out and do some girl stuff <laughs> yeah i just wanted to let you guys know that's why here's okay so i just finished eating let's see what my battery is at oh my god why is this going on if you haven't realized i'm not smart so <laughs> definitely don't know how to put a damn battery in Okay, let's see what this is gonna work. I'm back in action. So I had to switch to my phone because my camera keeps dying and I don't wanna deal with that. 
So I'm gonna take the um, Fit Me Maybelline powder. <laughs> palette and I take the lightest contour color as you can tell these are the two most used um, I don't do too much of it especially because I'm doing like a like a natural look I'm sorry there's a lot of sh like shadow the camera was way better than this the, the quality of this is shitty now I, I take this fluffy brush, the same brush that I used to um, for my lids. I take this one and I just tab on a little bit and I use that for my nose. And I go from the side, from like, like this out. I feel like it works it better and it's not as fluffy and it won't go anywhere. Same thing on this side. Kind of just like works with it. And then I take the big one, you want to take off all the excess of it, and just, just blend that all out. You can see? Now I just have a brown nose. I actually do like to bring it down here, just a tad bit, nothing too extra. I take this fluffy brush and I go and I just start blending everything. This lighting is not doing any good, but I promise it looks better. It's the lighting. And then I'm going to put lashes on. I use the Ardell. They're like these wispy lashes. They're like dramatic. I'll show you guys. I lost the packaging to it, but it's just, um, you could find them any drugstore where they sell like, I cut mine, so... You gotta make them fit your eye. I don't know. They're very, very wispy. You can see on the side. I like them personally. Super cheap lashes. Works well. You can give them a lot of... You can get a lot of usage out of them. For the glue, I like using the Kiss Strip Lash Glue. It works really well. I think it works better than the one that squeezes out. Clean out your, your stud. And you want it to look pretty, okay? See, now it's just... Ew, I have so much acne. I'm sorry. I have a lot of acne. So now I'm just going to glue my lashes on. I don't think I've... I'm going to film this, see if it goes well, and if it doesn't, I won't put it in. So, and I did curl my lashes. I curled my lashes and I put mascara on. I did one coat of mascara on each eye. Um just so I can prep them because um, if you don't your lashes just like well at least mine do they look just straight out and it just looks kind of like it just looks weird I'm gonna take the first lash okay. let me see if I can get this to zoom in Real quick, okay. Oh god. Taking the right eye and gluing this thing on. It's been sitting out for a little bit. So once it's in there. You just wanna make sure it's down as possible more towards um, the lid. So it just looks like it's part of the eyeliner. You wanna get some tears. I know you should before. Did you get some flat angle ones? Just like that. Your lashes. Again, the winged eyeliner. Pretty much done. I'm gonna put some highlighter on. Oh, what's on this side? I use the Lorac highlight. Mine's cracked, so it's not all pretty. I take 
the same fluffy brush I just clean it out just because I'm not using this a lot clean it out and I just take a little bit of the highlight take the axis off and just like that and then um I clean my lips up for lips I'm gonna use I'm just gonna use the Burt's Bee um the lip balm because my lips are super chapped and they need a heal I can get this shit to open I just take a little bit of it and lips I don't know why my lips get so chapped honestly maybe because I'm dehydrated okay now I'm gonna straighten my hair I thought it was recording Tin wet to straight um, straightener. It's a thicker one. It works really well. Don't recommend that you straighten your hair like because it says wet to straight. It's just not healthy. Trust me, I'm saying from experience. I'm not just being a bummy. I want people, everyone, just everyone that has viewed my video, I want them to go and comment one thing. Like, tell me something that you would want to see me film like anything honestly like i'm down to film anything not anything but like you know appropriate anything um i love doing challenges honestly my sister and i on our combined youtube channel i'm gonna try and link it down below if i don't forget um that way you guys can check us out we haven't filmed our first video we still are trying to decide what we want to do for our first video we want to do something like that's like sister appropriate, I guess, like like our sibling tag or like a um like the sister tag. I don't know. Something that will like you guys can get to know as like fifty questions and then we can go off of there or something. Tell tell me if that's a good idea, like the sibling tag or something for a sister channel. I don't know. Just comment down below on something that you want to see, okay? Because I'm down for everything. I can do all five of us together, which is we're four girls and one boy. I feel like this is a great platform to like help others and like for you to get to know them but anyway I'm ranting on to different stuff I'm gonna straighten my hair because they're waiting for me out there I just split my hair in half honestly I don't split it into like smaller pieces unless I want it to be like massively straight okay because my hair is already messed up I'm trying to go back to dark because my hair is so messed up from all the chemicals and everything, so. Hey, where's the drums? Ooh, girl, you're shining like a Fifth Avenue diamond. And they don't make you like they used to. You're never going out of style. My mind's thinking I was moved in the wrong time. One of a kind, living in a world gone plastic. Then I take a comb just to brush down, like, all the baby hairs or dead hairs that I have. And oh, this camera sucks. There you go out here. Okay, so this is my final look. I straightened my hair. I'm by the window, so you're wondering. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video and please, please, please give it a thumbs up. Again, leave some comment. comment down below. Subscribe if you're not subscribed. Please, please subscribe if you're not subscribed. Oh, I'm a little bit like clumsy. I'm new to this. I want to get to know everyone. I want everyone to get to know me. Thank you so much for watching.